I believe that startups, they have a real struggle going offshore. If I'm a large software company and I have a very clear vision of what it is I want built, offshoring makes sense. But at our stage where we're helping build a new piece of software, it is very, very difficult to work with an offshore company. They don't understand uh, the nuance or the ability to move and pivot and uh, change as quickly as we do. I, I'll tell you a, a little funny story, which is uh, I envision working with an offshore team in an early stage process like this. You walk into a restaurant, you talk to the uh, waiter, and there are no menus. You just have to describe what you think you want for dinner. And now that waiter is going to go back into the kitchen and the chef listening to the waiter is going to prepare a meal for you. And at the end of the day, they're going to walk out with a soup sandwich. It is sort of what you ordered, enough so that you have to pay for it. But it is definitely not edible and a very problematic to what you originally envisioned. The, the beauty of working with Code and Trust is you can talk to that waiter, sort of explain what it is you think you want, and we are capable of packaging that together, creating a plan that everybody can understand, and then, better yet, the people in the kitchen totally can also buy into that vision and craft something that makes sense for you that at the end of the day, you're really gonna enjoy it.